Let's take a look at what's happening in the local San Diego real estate market. Now, the one question I always get is now a good time to sell my San Diego home. I also get asked if we're going to be seeing a crash and what should people do with their homes and if they should wait to buy in case of a crash. Well, with the constant change in our world, it can be hard to see and make the right decision for you and your family with all that noise. Now, I totally understand. I've been in the industry now for over 15 years and I'm here to help you navigate this market. I've done hundreds of real estate transactions and when answering these questions, it's always a good idea to look at the data and what's happening in the market so that way you can make an educated decision. So let's do that. Let's see what the market looks like here locally and if it is a good time to sell your San Diego home. Now, let's peek at the month of February for just a second. Now at the end of February, the median price for a home was $777,000. That's up from $760,000 in January. The average days on market are 22 days and that's down by one day from January. And the average price per square foot jumped slightly to $593 a square foot. Now the number of homes sold in February was just over $2,300. So let's answer the second question I keep getting. Will we see a crash? Now there are two things that could cause a real estate market crash. If the United States enters war with Russia, which we were told that won't happen, or if the Fed raises rates too rapidly. Now, pressure is on rates to rise, and that is no secret. In fact, the first rate hike is coming any day, so be prepared. I think we should be expecting rates to reach as high as 5%, and if that happens, then we'll start to see a slowdown in the home pricing increases. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me at 619-818-2992. I'm Chris Spade at Keller Williams Realty, where I take the stress out of your real estate transactions. Thanks for watching. Thank you.